What's up guys? Welcome back. We are here in Las Vegas and I'm here with my friend Mark Serbu. So he brought his nice 20 millimeter uh, cannon and for you guys that don't know the difference this is a 50 BMG 50 cal and this is a 20 millimeter. Big difference and we are getting ready to shoot uh, some paper. We want to see how much paper it takes to stop a 20 millimeter. Slower than that. <laughs> Mark, how much does this thing weigh? Uh, it weighs uh, about 82 pounds without the mount. 82 pounds. And this is the casing for the 20 millimeter. I usually shoot yellow pages, but uh, I didn't want... <laughs> I usually shoot yellow pages. By the way, sorry about the wind. It is a little windy over here. We got the full box and there's 5,000 sheet in each box. 20 pounds each box and there's four of them and we're gonna shoot it with the 20 millimeters see if it can uh, stop that thing and uh, I don't know we'll see what happens this red tip uh, it has a tungsten penetrator inside sorry about the wind I hope it doesn't get too messed up but anyway so we'll shoot those uh, 20,000 sheet of paper down there and see if we'll go through it or stop it or what okay i think we are sighted in and ready to shoot so let's do this safety is off you guys are ready yep fire in a hole whoa <laughs> that a too much to the right we're gonna have to redo this Da -da -da -da. Man, that thing had a pretty good kick. Mark, what is that thing over ah, there? Ah, I burned my finger. <laughs> ah, I burned my finger. No, hold on. That's a copyright. You can't do that. I can't only do that. <laughs> okay, so what are we looking at here? What is that? That's the base of the cartridge. You want to cut it out? Or yeah. Good luck, right? Yeah, both sides. Dr. Mark and Dr. Edwin in the house. Oh, I almost got it. There it is. All right, so Mark, explain to us what this thing is. The penetrator, the tungsten penetrator sits in here and the plastic's all around it. And uh, so this just flies off somewhere, but we're so close that it was a part of the projector. Right over here. Came out of the second one. Came out of the second box. Nothing came out, so it's in it. Yeah, just open that. Like plaster almost. So what happened here? But nothing came out, right? All right, so we couldn't find that tungsten round. Uh, I think it uh, curved off from the side on the box. Okay, round. I don't know, three, four, or something. Okay, so. Center on the barcode. Fire the hole! Whoa, <laughs> that is center! <laughs> it can't get any more center than that. Let's see what happens. Show that. So that's that right there. So it hit the second box. Oh man, I got it right over here. That's that Towards the end of the second one is where we catch this. That's pretty can see it. I'm scared to touch it. Imagine how hot it'll be. Oh, oh man. Check that out. 
This is crazy. Look at that thing. Wow. It's still warm. Okay, so it looks like we went through the first box and towards the end of this one here. So it took two boxes to stop this uh, blue tip. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Isn't that what you're used to? Okay, let me shoot that. Back home. <laughs> I know, man. This is really fun that we just caught this. But since Mark brought this full automatic oh, put, AK. Put it in the middle position. On the other side. Wow. Where did you grab this thing at? <laughs> Careful, hold it down. Okay, so this is a real... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Total fail. This is the real Russian AK-47, full automatic. All right. Oh man. <laughs> Come on, let me have this thing. Oh, okay. This is like, oh wow. If you guys have never tried shooting a full automatic AK-47, I definitely recommend you guys do it. Okay, Mark, so what's the difference between this one and the red tip? Uh, the that uh, one's red. The red one's red. <laughs> no, would the red tip have gone deeper? Oh yeah, definitely. So this is, what do you think like the difference would be? Like if you would have caught the red tip one, the tungsten one? We'll find it. We'll shoot another one. Now you want to shoot another in. one? So Mark is saying let's shoot another tungsten. I said no. It's... <laughs> I love the way you're just standing here with an AK-47. <laughs> I say we shoot another red one. Okay. Mark really wants to shoot that tungsten, but I said let's save those for the... Um, for other targets we have lined up. So it takes between two of these to stop this blue tip. This is a piece of metal with some uh, marks that had some aluminum stuff inside of it. So it stopped it at two boxes. A regular red tip tungsten round would have probably gone through three maybe max and it would have stopped it. In case you guys are wondering, I know one piece fell out here somewhere. We couldn't find it unfortunately. I will leave a link to Mark Serbu's uh, website and channel in the description box. I hope you guys enjoyed this again. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you. We'll see you guys next time.